Hi friends. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, if you're new here, my name is Amber and I'm mama to all. Um, I like to share food bank hauls, simple tanning, preserving, uh, ways to save money, frugal tips, a little bit of it all. Some simple Southern cooking, um, thrift, uh, thrift store hauls, just little odds and ends in my life. I share my life with you guys. So if you're new here and this is the kind of content you like, uh, do me a favor and hit that subscribe button down below. Uh, turn your notification bell on and join me for the ride. So it is Sunday here and it is a food bank day. It is the food bank that you actually get to shop and pick your items out, say yes, say no. You get say so as to what you receive. Um, there's limits on things. They're numbered. There's usually someone walking close by, one of the volunteers that help assist you along the way. So, yeah, I actually have a nice little, little amount of food here. Um, I've had a great weekend though. So for the ones that have been following me know that last week was kind of hectic and I worked and worked and worked and worked and worked last weekend. And I did not work this weekend. I have had a great weekend. Um, I've not really done much of anything. I've done a few things around the house, a couple canning projects, um, but that was about it. Um, I didn't even wash any clothes this weekend, if that says something. I got clean clothes, so it's okay. Um, well, I take that back. My husband washed clothes. I did not wash clothes. He just said, uh-uh, I did. <laughs> so, but yeah, so I've had a great weekend. I feel refreshed, which means go back to work tomorrow, four o'clock. Get up, start all over. But yeah, well, let me get you guys turned around because my stomach is growling and I am hungry and ready to eat something. So I'm gonna get you turned around and show you guys what we received. All right, so we're gonna start over here on the left side with these meats and cold items. I grabbed this pack of hot Italian sausage. That is something that looked good to me. I like the spice. Um, so there we have that one pound of locally butchered ground beef this is a local uh farm we have that donates uh excess to the food banks and so we all got one pound of that everybody got one of these red baron pizza melts so i'm assuming that was like a overstock or something that they had that a grocery store donated and then I picked out some boneless, plain, cold, boneless wings. I figured I'll throw those in the freezer in a baggie and I can always heat those up and, you know, lunch, make a little potato bowl. I can figure something out with them. And then produce, everybody got six, well, two packs of three of these garlic. So that was nice to get. Um, always cooking with garlic. I grabbed a Chiquita Bites Savory. It has apple wedges, cheddar cheese, and pretzels. Figured that would be great to throw in the lunch. Mm, looks perfectly fine to me. I grabbed a chop. They had a bunch of different salad bags, and you could grab one. They all were the cabbage salad. And if y'all paid attention to my last one, I do not care for the cabbage salad. I did grab this and I grabbed it for several different reasons. My chickens love the cabbage. I wanted the yogurt poppy seed dressing, the dried cranberries and the pumpkin seeds because I still have some of the other salad that I got. And if you'll notice here, they're individually packaged within it. I can use that for a different salad. So I grabbed that. Four beautiful tomatoes. Mine are just coming from my garden, but mine are much smaller right now. So those are mine, but four beautiful uh, tomatoes. I grabbed this. I love soup and I love butternut too. So I grabbed this creamy butternut squash soup. Sounded really good to me. Um, and it's almost, you know, soup season. And I mean, the ingredients on here are very nice and clean. But I personally, I love soup. Soup is my go-to. A box of mac and cheese. And haha, <laughs> the husband will be happy. A box of chicken and a biscuit crackers. He loves those. 
one can of cream of chicken soup. I pass on the veggies because for the most part, I can my veggies, so I have those on the shelf. But I always grab stuff like this because I cook with this. And when I saw that, what crossed my mind was, hey, we haven't had a chicken pot pie in a while, or we haven't had a shepherd's pie, and I use the cream of something soups when I'm doing those kind of casseroles. I have one Dr. Pepper Zero Sugar, one Capri Sun Strawberry Kiwi. That's always nice to have. They don't always give drinks, but you know, they had them, one of each. A thing of these Feastables Mr. Beast cookies. This is empty, you guys, because I ate these on the way home. I know. But I told you, I'm hungry. And it was a small bag. That's just, you know, one of the little tiny bags of Cheetos Puffs. They're gone. But I ate them. I got a bag of Cheez-Its. Three-ounce bag. I got four of these Cheddar Cheese Crackers. I got, this was pretty neat. They had a bunch of different ones to pick from. And it said, just add, blend with oranges, water, and ice. Orange quick smoothie mix. I thought that was pretty interesting. One packet, orange smoothie mix. Three oranges, peeled and divided. Half a cup of water, and one and one fourth cups ice. You don't have to follow that, I'm assuming. Because what is this? Well, it's got sugar, milk. So basically this is like your, the milky part of the smoothie, I would assume. But I thought that was pretty neat to have on hand. I got some beautiful croissants. These are very large croissants at, at that. They're not your tiny ones. I love a good croissant. And y'all will actually see this be eat tonight. I'll show y'all when y'all finally see this week's what we eat in a week video. Next weekend when I post it, you'll, you'll see these be used up, so. Tortilla Pockets Kit. Now, if you remember, I have one of these on the shelf. I actually got these the last time I went, and I have not used them yet. Um, but I think I have an idea as to how to use them. My husband showed me a thing where you can close up the tortilla almost, like a whole, an actual like pocket where it's closed up and kind of pan fry them. So I might try that. For dessert, these are a little um, beat up, but my youngest daughter, she don't care. She loves little mini cupcakes. I saw those and thought about her instantly. Um, this looked great to me. I have never in my life, in my 36 years, had a fruit tart. I have no clue what I'm getting myself into, but I love fruit and it looks absolutely delicious. So, I'm excited for that. I'll probably have a piece of that after, after dinner. And then, look at this. San Francisco style sourdough traditional English muffins. One, two, three, four, six pack. That was excellent because one of my favorite breakfast things is a good sourdough English muffin. So, that is what we received as far as the food items. This was also the same food bank that I have told you guys that when you're done shopping for your food items, you go out into the carport and there's extras with clothing and stuff. So, let's see here. I found some items. And let's see here. This is a nice white shirt, long sleeve. Vineyard Vines, Washington, D.C. shirt. I thought it was pretty neat. I mean, it's a political on the back with the well. But, you know, it's a long sleeve shirt. Keeping in mind that it's getting ready to get cold. I got... Trying to hold you guys still so that you can see. Another Vineyard Vines pink long sleeve hoodie. Um, it's real thin. It's not... Not one that you're going to wear like over your clothes. Maybe wear it as your shirt. Um, have no clue. This one I thought was kind of cute. It's, I don't know. I really don't. Um, 
I just, it's a raglan tee. It's super soft. I wish you guys could feel it through the phone or the video. But it just, you know, it says North Cedar Point NC. I guess it's like a destination shirt. Um, I could care less. I thought it was super soft. And again, a long sleeve shirt. I did grab a couple pairs of shorts for my youngest daughter. I had her in mind. Maybe she can wear these. If so, is that not soft? Yes. Um, if she can wear these, great. If not, I will donate them back. But a nice pair of jean shorts. And then, oh, I found this. Really super soft hooded sweater, guys. Another, I'm all about soft. And I love really big. It's a loft. And then it's even got the pocket. That could be paired with a pair of leggings. And stay nice and warm. And let's see here. This is the other pair of shorts I found for my daughter. Some like gym style shorts. She can wear them out or on the house, whatever she feels like doing. Um, and last but not least, mama wanted another gown. And guess what? They had a gown. This makes number two. I now own two gowns. Well, if I can get it straightened out for you guys. All right, it's got some lemons on it. It's just a simple, simple gown. Something comfy to wear. So, there you have it. And that's my bag. I That's the bag I used to take the eggs. And let me just say they were super ecstatic with all those eggs. Um, able to help many families because what they ended up doing was breaking them down even more where I divided the 18 packs in half they pulled out some empty containers they had and they divided it to where families were getting six a piece six eggs each so able to help several families out and yeah feels good to be able to give back to the people that are helping you as well so all right you guys it is time for me to get off of here and get me something to eat but first i gotta get this stuff put away and you guys take care until next time